Austin's lakes and creeks are essential to our city, providing drinking water and recreational opportunities. But these same waterways can create problems such as flooding, erosion, and water pollution. When it rains, the soil absorbs some of the rainfall. The rest becomes overland flow called stormwater runoff. It flows off of property and reaches the drainage system or a creek. This simulator shows how natural areas absorb rainfall. Let's pretend this sponge is a grassy area. As you can see, the water is easily absorbed by the sponges. The creek in this model was able to accommodate the stormwater runoff. This type of surface, one that allows water to easily soak into the soil, is called a pervious area. This represents a parking lot, a type of impervious cover. Impervious cover also includes roofs, driveways, and patios, and other areas where the landscape cannot easily absorb the rainfall. This time, the creek is not able to handle this amount of rainfall in such a short time, causing flooding for these houses. Let's look at a different situation. Let's reduce the amount of impervious area in the parking lot. These sponges can represent landscaping. The resulting flow is less than with the entire parking lot. If we compare our bottles, we can see the different amounts of stormwater generated by the natural area, the parking lot in combination of natural area, and the parking lot. This model shows the effect of stormwater runoff in a creek, but the same holds true for a roadside ditch or a storm drain. As stormwater runoff increases, our drainage system needs to be more robust to help prevent flooding, erosion, and water pollution. For more information, please visit the website on the screen.